Let's just do something simple so, like a turtle real quick. All right, so if we go like so. 2,000, look at that. Like it was nothing. What's going on guys, TBF Gaming, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Evolved, we're playing Center Eternal, the center map, Ark Eternal. Let's get into some things today. So in the last episode, uh, we got this guy, the amazing, super amazing Poison Pteranodon. So let me, let me make sure I'm saying this right. This is the, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is the Eternal Alpha Poison Pteranodon. This is one of the evolutions. If you find yourself an Alpha Pteranodon, you can evolve it into this Poison Pteranodon. Absolutely awesome. We are going to go straight to what we said we are going to do in the last episode. I want to get one of these Spinos. There's a couple of these super awesome Poison Spinos over here. I want to see if I can get one of these guys knocked out. Should be right over here. What do we got down there? Megalania. There's, I know there's one over here. So there's that one there. Right here. He's fighting something. Oh, he's fighting a cursed trike. That's not your best idea. He's about to knock him out, though. There, he, there he's out. There you go. He's got about 650,000 Torpor, so he, he's giving us a little bit of trouble. we got to watch out for this guy as well. There's the uh, Dire Wolf. He's got super low Torpor, so if we hit him one time, he's going to knock out. But we just got to make sure he doesn't hit us, because if he hits us, it's over. <laughs> we, are, uh, we are not making it if he hits us first. There we go. Hit him. Got to watch our Torpor, make sure it's not going up at all. All right, did he knock out? He did. Uh... I don't know if we're going to even bother taming him. We could real quick. We could put some food on there just to tame him up real quick. Just to knock it out. Let's do that. Let's do that. We're going to go gather all the stuff. Oh, no, no. Microraptor. Nope. Oh, I hate those guys so much. Hold on. Where did he go? That's not him, is it? That was him. We missed. I'm going to see if I can take this guy out without him hitting us. There we go. We got him horrible little guys all right so before we got distracted there here's the spinal we're going after like i said he's sitting at already 600,000 torpor so let's see if we can do this real quick i've got the poison uh eraser already on my bird's uh inventory so we can use it if we get hit there we go he's getting close to two million already so it's not going to take very many hits here let's do this again there we go get out get out get in get out there you go. There's two million. All right, it's gonna take a couple more here. There you go. Yeah, he's getting he's getting dizzy. He's ready to go down. There we go. There you go. Go to sleep, big dude. 2.8, 2.9. Don't go in the water. There, he's out. Nice. Oh, what kind of terrain done are you? Just regular. Ah. Oh. All right. I need some prime meat i don't have any of the really good meat to tame these guys up yet uh the alpha meat the eternal meat or even cooked lamb chop i don't even have that but i can get some uh prime meat kind of fast right let's see prime meat will still take quite a bit wow cooked prime meat 85 raw mutton 85 yeah this guy's gonna be a pretty intense tame so this is gonna take quite a while let's see let me see if I can get into any of the uh, the eternal meat stuff. I don't think I can yet, but let me just double check. All right. We haven't really added much more to the base. What you guys saw in the last one is about what we have done. We've added a few more foundations up top, but nothing too much. I'll try to finish a little more in between the next two episodes. We just didn't have time this weekend to really jump on and play. We were pretty, playing pretty heavy on our Aberration series and playing pretty heavy on Dark and Light, so we've been super busy. All right, let me see here. So of these ones, I don't think we can do... All right, the eternal meat, dino DNA, we definitely don't have. Yeah, so DNA is is the shortfall right now. We don't have that. And then I think the other one, the insta tame, have we not even learned that? Hold on. Insta, that one doesn't unlock till later, but I think one of these guys can make it. But once again, I don't think we have the stuff for it. Yeah, look, you need 25 DNA, so there's no way we're getting that one. Uh, Let's see, we do have some cooked prime meat. I guess we could use that. And I want to say we had mutton chops at one point, but I don't know what we did with it. Does one of you guys have it? Let me just double check. No, not on any of you guys. And if these spinos are anything like real spinos, it might be really hard because these guys 
might lose our torpor really fast. Let's go check on him. Let's go check on him and find out. There he is. And no, because he's got 3.1 million torpor, so it's not going down too fast. All right. Let's jump off here. We'll put this meat on him. Now, it should go somewhat fast because his food is all the way down, so it's, he's going to eat quickly. So even though it's only doing 1% or 2% per, he's going to eat like crazy. All right, cool. Let's wait on him for a few minutes, and I'll bring you guys back in a few minutes, and hopefully we'll get a chance to try this guy out today. All right, guys, we put a little bit of prime meat on the dire wolf real quick just so we can see if we can possibly get him up. Uh, and it's going really fast, so I think we got him. There we go. We did it. Eternal poison dire wolf. Look at this guy. Oh, look at that. He's only got one glowing eye. That's kind of crazy looking. Look at that. The one glowing eye. That is pretty cool looking, actually. Look at that. That's a definite screenshot. All right, very cool. Let's let's jump on this guy. Let's see how he is. All right, so we did fix the leveling and mechanics on here. So now when we add stats, it should be adding at a good rate now. Uh, before you know, before we do anything, let's get our buddy inside. We're not leaving you out here. Okay. Oh, is he on follow? Hold on. Stay right there. We'll pick him up real quick and we'll take him back. There we go. We'll go right over here. We'll drop our bird off. The one thing we don't want to do is leave our bird out at all, anywhere. All right. Drop you right there. Land right there ourselves. All right. Let's go test this guy out real quick. So only 293. He's not a super high level one, but he's high enough level. That it'll be a little bit of fun. That super amazing jump. Oh, he is not fast in the water, though. Let's get out of the water. Please don't come get me baryonyx. There we go. There we go. So not bad damage to start off with. 2,000 damage? That is a pretty good starting point. Nope, you get away. All right, make sure we get that guy before he gets us. What did he try to take? Oh, he took our cooked meat. Don't do that. All right, let's go check on our Spino. Spino should be flying right along over here. Should be a pretty good percentage. Oh my god, is it up already? Did we miss it? Oh, I think we missed it, guys. Let me see. We did. Level 779. Look at that. Eternal Poison Spino. Let's go get... Oh, Compy sneaking up on us. Let me go see if I can get a saddle made up for the Spino guy real quick. And then we'll go play around the Spino a little bit. Alright, so just so we can see it, the Dire Wolf has his normal attack, which he's doing about 2,000 damage. Alright. He's got the right click, which is the howl. So there you go. Let's, let's take a look at that real quick. So there you go. A little bit of howl action. <laughs> Pretty funny. And then, and then of course, he has his beam, which is... Hold on, let's get out of that. Which is left click or C button. It is the C button. There you go. So you can kind of see it's got some pretty serious uh, torpor effect there. Yep. Uh, he's going down. You're going to come at me, but you're not going to get me. All right. So not too bad. He's already got some levels on, but we're not going to throw him on just yet. All right. Let's finish eating him. Come on, come on. There we go. All right. Super cool. Let me throw this guy in base real quick, and then I'm going to see if I can get a Spino saddle made up, and then we will test out the super amazing uh, poison Spino over there. So we, we're going to continue to build around the base over here. The plan is, I, I know I've told you guys this in the past episode, just so you guys know, the... Uh, what do you call this? The ruins area is eventually going to be like a giant museum of, of tames and dinos. There's so many cool different tames here in this. Oh, we got some villagers hanging out over here. What is up, man? What is up? Eventually, we'll tame those guys, too. Oh, they're right there. Look at that. They built right below us. That's not the best idea, guys. Let me see. Any more of you guys? Yeah, that's not a great idea, man. <laughs> I don't know where you guys are at, but that's, that's not the best place to build. All right, let's go inside. But we will try to tame those guys up, too. Apparently, you can tame those up kind of passively. All right, let's go park this guy. We'll park him right over here next to our other our, uh, saber over here. All right, like so. All right, very cool. Make sure you're not following. Let's see about this saddle real quick. All right. So we'll go Spino. Hopefully, I have unlocked it. All right, it should just be the regular Spino, right? Spino. We have all the stuff for it. We do, perfect. All right, great. 
Uh, so in the last few episodes, hopefully you guys have seen all these other ones that we've got tamed up. We've got our super amazing Alpha Carno. We've got a couple of these guys. We've got the uh, Elemental Turtle, which is awesome. We definitely want to see the other ones. We haven't got a chance to see the other ones. There's also uh, Dillo, which we'll hopefully get tamed up in the next few episodes. Uh, I think it's already live. I can't remember for sure. I know we saw the spoiler picture of it, and I heard someone else talking about it already. So I think it's already live on servers. All right. Let's get over here kind of quickly. All right. Oh, come on. Get out of the water. We gotta do our little Spider Man impersonation. Get over here kind of quickly. There we go. Oh, man, we missed. We could just go straight across, but there's usually like a Baryonyx over here that we gotta be a little careful of. All right. Hopefully, nothing over here is gonna get us real quick. We'll get over here, get on the Spino, test him out real quick. They look amazing. I'm I'm really happy with the uh, the the way they designed these ones with the the glowing eyes and stuff. I think it looks really cool. Uh, definitely a cool addition. All right, there he is. Look at that. Look at that. And he's got a little uh, green like smoke mist coming off of him. Very cool. And we still got to be careful. We got to still watch out for any of the uh, other poison dinos because I don't know if they added where these guys are going to be immune to. Uh, the actual like poison effects. I'm not really sure yet. Oh, hungry. I got food. That works out perfectly. All right, let's go test it out. Look at that saddle. I've always loved spinos. I think spinos are one of the coolest uh, dinos in the game, either base or or like this. So 5,000 damage starting off. What level are we starting off? 779. He's already starting at, look at this, 1.9 million health. Super amazing. Melee 826. Movement speed 100. Uh, weight, who cares? Uh, oxygen is 1,635, which matters for swimming. All right, so let's pump speed just a little bit. It's going to take quite a few of that to get him going anywhere. But All right, and it should be right-click should do the thing where he stands up on two legs, right? And then does he still get the water bonus? He does, gets a little water bonus. So now when we do damage, we're doing 5,000 like that. Let's see what he does slapping. 5,800. Okay. So let's make sure we got the water bonus. We'll go over here and we'll test the slap one more time. Yep. So 5,800. There we go. Okay. So it looks like it's not, there's no difference between the two. Now, does he have a special attack? So he does like a growl with the C button. Control does not. Okay. So he doesn't. This one doesn't do a beam like the other guys, but he definitely does torpor damage. If we go up against something a little bigger, you'll be able to see it. All right, let's see if you got a little bit of speed through the water. Are you fast through the water? Not, not incredibly fast. <laughs> definitely not fast. We'd have to level that up just a little bit. All right, let's eat this guy. Oh, come on. How much health does that guy have? Holy cow. All right. Definitely start pumping melee here. Let's give this guy a little bit of super amazing damage. There we go. Over a thousand damage. Let's pump speed just a little more. All right. Let's go. Now go all four so we can move. There we go. We'll go over here and, and chomp some more things. Let's watch out. There's a poison raptor up there. Let's not mess with that guy. And we will go out and actually retame up the raptors. And all the trikes, so we have all of them. I know uh, one of the commenters wanted us to try to uh, breed up a couple of the elemental trikes, so I guess we got to try that eventually. All right. What's inside there? Anything? No. We could go eat some villagers, but I'm not too concerned with that just yet. Let's go over to the main island and go eat some things over here. I don't think we have to be too careful over there. All right. Get up over here. It has been raining a lot on the center map. I don't know what's going on with all this extra rain. All right, let's get across. Anything good in here? Chitin leggings and a stego saddle. Let's go check those out. All right, got to definitely start hitting some of these drops so we can start uh, gathering up our blueprints. There we go. All right. Let's see who we can attack and what we can do over here. All right. There we go. A 580 turtle. We could have probably tamed that. All right. So 7,300 damage. That is pretty good. Uh, the water 
bonus wears off here in just a second once we get up here. You know what? The water bonus should act while you're actually running around in the rain also. All right, guys. We're doing pretty pretty fair damage right now. Let's, let's see what we can do against these fire guys. I want to take them out kind of quickly. Hopefully not get burned too bad. Uh, if you take these guys out, they do give you some really good drops. Let's go get him, get him, get him. Finish him off. And hopefully we actually get him before he passes out. That's the big thing is you want to actually have him not pass out. You want to actually eat him. I don't think we're going to make it. Oh, he passed out. Okay. Yeah, we couldn't eat him fast enough. <laughs> there we go. All right. So we did take out one or two before they actually passed out. Here's what we actually got off of them. We finally got the Dino DNA, two of them. So we can actually make one of the either Alpha or one of the different Prime meats. All right, what is this guy? A Pegasus. Hmm. Yeah, not really. Don't really want to attack that guy just yet. All right, Electric Raptor will definitely avoid. All right, I'm going to head back towards base. Okay, we got a little bit of a problem. <laughs> we took on a... Uh, we're taking on a dire wolf. Now, the good news is we found out the hard way that we are immune to the poison attack of the dire wolf. So that's a good thing. Uh, we're also finding out the hard way that the Demetrodon is a pain because it starts hitting you. Oh, do we knock it down? Oh, we knocked it down. Hold on. Let's go over here. We should be able to take these guys out as well. Let's do this. Okay, get him. Come on. Come on. All right, and we don't do we don't do torpor to them as well. That's actually a good thing. Okay. Okay, come on. There we go. There we go. There we go. All the damage. Let's do it. So that's really good. So we don't take poison. Uh, we don't get torpor from those guys, which is great. All right, let's grab some of this prime meat. Now this guy should be empty on food, right? Yeah, there it is. Let's tame up this little guy. All right, let's go throw the prime on there, and I think that's going to be enough. You think? What do you think? Uh, let's get a little more just in case. I'm a little worried. All right, we'll grab the regular meat just in case. Just in case we'll have that on there. I think that's going to be enough, but we'll have both of them on there. All right, cool. Let's get a little uh, fire demorphodon tamed up. These would be really cool to take into a cave. Some of these little guys that are uh, can set things on fire. I think that'd be pretty sweet. All right, there we go. The fire demorphodon is ready to go. Check this little guy out. Let's definitely get a little picture of this guy as well. Look at that, that little fire guy. I think we're definitely gonna have to throw this at some people. Let's uh, let's see. Let's make sure that you are on some kind of aggressive here. Let's see. Hold on. Let's make sure you are on aggressive. See, stance, aggressive, and there you go. Let's go see if we can throw this at something real quick. All right, there's a poison trike. We don't really need that guy. Let's just do something simple like a turtle real quick. All right, so if we go like so. 2,000, look at that. Like it was nothing. Okay, finish taking him out. Where's our little Demorphodon, buddy? There we go. Okay, come back. All right, guys, we're going to make one of these Alpha Prime meats. I don't think we'll have a chance to use it today. Uh, but let's grab a couple of hearts. We just need a few of those. I've already got the Dino DNA. Let's see. We also need some Prime meat. So there's Prime meat. There's DNA and hearts. And... We're short one. Hold on. Okay, stop. Stop, stop, stop. What are we missing here? Am I missing one more one more DNA? Do I not have another one? I know we grabbed some more. Did it go missing? Uh, maybe it's on our spino. I think I just forgot to bring it inside. Let me see. All right. Uh, there we go. There we go. I was going to say, I know we had more. All right. So we'll do this. We will go like this. We'll throw that and that on there. And then we'll do this kind of quickly. Did it make it? It did. It made six of them. There you go. So we got six of the alpha meat now. We'll go ahead and let that cook the rest of that prime meat into regular meat. Uh, plus, we've got all the metal and meat we've got to put back on there. 
There you go, making all kinds of things up. Absolutely perfect. All right, guys, so that's going to do it for today. We got a chance to try out the Alpha Spino. We got ourselves a new Alpha, non Alpha, a Eternal Poison Dire Wolf uh, to add to our awesome collection of tames. Uh, what I'm going to do now is, as I get ready to log off for the days, I'm going to make up a few more foundations and ramps and kind of finish out this top level. I've got this level built up, and then what I want to do is we got to start getting into metal pretty soon so we can actually start. Uh, getting into metal and then glass and I want to put glass windows here uh, but we may do stone doors just to get it started but I want to eventually do glass the whole way around so alright guys so the eternal hold on let's get the name right the elemental poison spino is absolutely amazing definitely try it out if you get a chance to uh, I really like how much damage these guys do and I like a lot of the different models for it I've also seen the ones that are a little more green and I like the way those guys look as well all right, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode of ARK Survival Evolved Center Eternal.